Hello, welcome to Pure Science Education and today I will look in at only a few unit conversions that you will need for your physics exam in GCSE and in A level. And I'll give you a rule where you convert if you have a larger number into a smaller unit, then you multiply, and if you're doing it the other way around, you will divide. So let's look at a few of them. So if I'm going from milligram to gram, because it's smaller, uh, it becomes 0 0.001. That means I have divided by a thousand kilo to grams. One kilogram is a thousand gram. So kilo means thousand. Nanometer stands for something times 10 to the minus 9. Micrometers 10 to the power of 6. If I'm going from centimeters to meters, then I'm dividing it by 100. Millimeters to meter is again dividing by 1,000. Um, kilometers to meter is again 1,000 because it's a kilo. Kilo means 1,000. One milliliter is um, 0 0.001 liter, so I've divided it again. And one centimeter is equal to one milliliter. I hope this really helps you and I'll get some more conversion readers up to you.